As many young people continue venturing into the Duakali industry, we meet John Ndolo, who has been into the industry as a waiver for 19 years. Kada ni mefika apa Nairobi, nika andikuwa kazi. Kada ni andikuwa kazi, nika fanya mwezi tatu, nika futwa. Kasi ya mjengo tu, kaingia kazi ya usoja. Nika fanya mwaka moja pia, nika futwa. Kada ni futwa, nika ona apana. Nikumbuke ile kazi nilikuwa nafanya nyumbani. Nikaanza kushona basket ndogo ndogo kama hizi kwa hapa nyuma. Kutembea kidogo nikakuta nimeanza kuusa. Kuusa tu pei rais kama 300 bila msini. Na nikakuta kwamba hiyo hata imenisaidia kuliko ile mjengo nilikuwa nafanya ama ile usoda nilikuwa nafanya. Na nifurahisha kwa sababu despite lack of enough capital, he was able to start off his business with little cash. Kile wakati nilifutwa kwa usoda, walinipatia kitu 1015. Na wakati huo ilikuwa 2001. Nikaona hizo 1015 badala ya nikule ama nifanyie vitu zingine, niende ninunue material nione kama inaweza kuniboost. Si kuweka yote Nilioka kama elefutano, elefukumi nikaweka mahali. Nikezi kama ndaona hita nipeleka vizuri, inaeza kunisaitia. Lakini ni kwa ati mzuri kani nipeleka vizuri, uh, siku rudi nyuma tena. Jones encourages small medium entrepreneurs who want to venture into the industry but has no capital. Mutu asitegemea tu ati yo, oh, nikona pesa kidoka, nikona pesa mingi. Biashara ukianza na pesa mingi, hautaendelea anza na biashara na pesa kidogo ndio uone vile inapanda ikiguro itakuwa easier kujua kwamba inaanguka ama inaendelea lakini ukianza na pesa mingi ni rahisi kuwa nguvu kwa sababu utachua eh, faida ni gani na ashara ni wapi naona sasa ndio maana nasema kwamba kama kuna mtu ambaye kwa mashambana angependa kuanzisha biashara asiokope anze na, na zile pesa ako nazo na awe na account pili awe na kitabu anaandika juu kwamba nimetoa ngapi na nimeingisha ngapi leo hii wiki nimekuwa na faida ama nimekuwa na asha In terms of competitiveness he says that entrepreneurs should review the competition as part of nature and embrace it positively Ni vizuri kuwa na mtu ambaye tunakompete na yeye ili nikaweze kuongeza ujuzi kabisa juu hata siku anafanya vile anafanya namna hii lakini wakati naona mtu anafanya na ongezea ujuzi wangu ili kitu yangu iwe kitu mzuri ipendwe na custom for creativity and innovation this is how one can source ideas vitu zingine huwa naenda internet lakini sana sana mingi huwa naletewa na customer designs customer anakuja na design plan na ijaribu uh, pengine na ijaribu nafanya vibaya na niambie sijafanya vibaya na rekebisha hivyo hivyo mpaka nakuta nafanya kitu na naisoea as a small business entrepreneur, Jones insists that entrepreneurs should have a bookkeeping system which will help monitor business accounts. Na nafikiri watu wengi wanaokopa kufungua kazi kwa sababu ya mipangilio, hawana. Chukua kitabu, hata kama ni mayai. Kama ni tray moja uko nayo, andika chini kwamba niko na tray moja nimenua pesa fulani. Kwa hizo pesa ninataka niuze pesa fulani. Ndapata faida ya pesa fulani. In every business there are times to make profits and losses and in times of losses he tells us on how he overcomes his financial challenges. Biashara unajua inaweza kuna ukuta iko chini unausa kitu moja unatumia sababu wa usef nikaishiwa. Kabidi sasa nikakimbilia mahali tena kutafuta capital nyingine. Nilienda kwa group wakanisaidia pesa na ilikuwa inalipwa na riba na ndiye nikachukua kama 10000 zingine wakaniambia ndalipa 10000 ndalipa 2000 on top sasa nikafanya hivyo na kusema kweli nilipa deni yao na sasa saa hizi na deni sasa nikaingia kwa America round moja ambayo nilikuwa na save uh, 1000 kila wiki sasa kuna sababu ya maana kwa sababu lakini angalia sako yenye anaingia ndani ya wawe ni watu wako trusted itamsaidia hata si lazima aingie kwa 1000 naweza ingia hata kwa 200 Kuna hata wale wanafanya mbao mbao kila siku kama ni biashara kidogo na ana boost biashara yake. Having been in the industry for quite some time, Jones gives his advice to young entrepreneurs. Mimi ushauri ningepewa vijana ni kwamba wengi husema kwamba hakuna kazi. Kama mimi ningekuwa mmoja wao kusema hakuna kazi ingekuwa nimefanya hii kazi. 
sio lazima upate ile kazi hata amesoma kazi ni kazi The Juwakali sector in Kenya is an entire industry comprising small scale traders and artisans who work on the roadside renowned for their ability to create almost anything on demand. The Kenyan government however has recognized the important role played by the informal sector Juwakali in addressing the challenges of poverty reduction and creating employment thus ensuring that the sector receives attention and financial inclusion like any other sectors. Njeri Njogu for Able TV.